Yeah. What? One for, for the eleven year olds, twelve year olds. But then as well as I say, I, I was very small, so the only reason I was put in goal is because they were afraid to put me outfield. When you're ready there, will you come up and eat? Pat, me up. Uh, come here, Johnny, get your picture taken over here. Ah, okay. The captain's on the 15 team, the huddle team. Oh, we've thrown out of guys for that age group, and a few of them we got in that was over the 15. We used to play uh, in the university, at the back of the university there was a pitch across from the where Cameron's uh, post office is now in Newcastle. Right. There was an entrance in there and there was a pitch in at the back of the university. Yes. And we used to play all like the underage, the under 15 we used to play in that, in that area. Now that would be roughly about 1954, 55. Okay. And was there a, an organised competition for under 16, under 18? No, there was. There was. There was under 15, then your next grade was under 18. Minor. Okay. So like, there was a lot of guys on the minor team that time that was under 16 and under, under 17. Okay. Like that age group, because you didn't have... You had to make up the numbers. Make up the numbers. Okay. And then in the lead up to the minor Westport final, who did you meet along the way? Uh, like Ra Rahon was one team, there was St. St. Kieran's I think, was one of the teams in Galway. Castle Gare was another team. Now on the Castle Gare team that time, there was some of the Egan's playing. I remember Egan, I remember I was marking a guy, Tommy Egan, I think I was marking in that game. That'd be roughly, that'd be now 1957 and 58, those years in the minor. And you were saying that you met uh, Kilimer Daly, was it maybe? Kilimer Daly, I think we met in the junior game, in junior, that'd be now, I think it's 59. And I think it's, I'm not sure now whether we beat them or not, but I know that we met Gart. We played them in in Cairn Bridge. It would be 1950, no, that would be 58 now. It's 58 we, we played Gart. That was a, 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 a junior game in Gart. And I, I'm not sure now whether that was the county final or the county semi final. And to get to those matches, that must have been difficult. Well, to get there, I know that game in 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 in, in Clarendon Bridge that they hired two buses to walk my column okay, at that time. Being that was, I think it was the county final from back then. That'd be roughly about, I think, it was October 1958. Okay. And then now I know that also that Josie Gallagher. Was playing in gold. This is the great Josie Gallagher. Great Josie Gallagher. Right. Playing in gold for guard. I think it was one of the last games that he played. Brilliant. His son now is living in my corner. Oh yeah. That's right. Oh, that's that's right. right. Something. And then you were yeah. saying you 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 were you were away for the '64. Well, you see, I immigrated then in in '59, uh, uh, late '59. And did many of your friends leave at the same time or? Uh, well, see, ever so often like they used to go, like, you know, like to be in England or kick off to England. You know, every year like a few of them would go. Okay. And, and yes, uh, America and Tom Box was a big destination for a lot of my Cullen hurlers as well and my Cullen football. New York, I played. New York. New York. And who did you play for with New York? Well, Galway, Galway juniors and Galway seniors. See, Kenneth Crook at the time was the goalie. I was the goalie and Kenneth Crook was the goalie for the for the New York team, so I mostly played it like on the junior team. But then as well as that, it, it, it depends. And what was it like in New York in the 1950s? Hi, Dad! Well, I know that there was, uh, there, was, there was an awful lot of young Irish. An awful lot of young Irish. And uh, I know at Gaelic Park now there was an awful lot of games, like they used to start their games at about 11 o'clock or 12 o'clock and they'd go on and about 7, there might be 5 or 6 games every uh, And they'd have Sunday. top class hurlers because Pori, of the immigration. Hey Pori. How are you doing? Pori Keeler. <laughs> and Pori Keeler we'll get to later on.